Hey, welcome back to Music Theory Logic. My name's Andrew. Last time I saw you, we talked about making MIDI piano feel a lot more realistic. I thought it'd be fun to write an instrumental with that uh, chord progression that we got. So let's go ahead into the Logic session. So here we are in uh, Logic Pro. Again, this is the session that we used uh, to take this computer sounding chord progression. make it feel a lot more realistic, like it was played by a human being, and we came up with this. Nice, we added imperfection in, we used the sustain pedal, but let's go ahead and uh, write some other stuff to this. So one, let's uh, slow our tempo down slightly. Let's go with like 106. Cool. I'm gonna keep this pretty simple and quick. Let's uh, open up an instance of Serum. Let's take our MIDI to that instance of Serum. Let's turn on an arpeggiator to arpeggiate that riff. Let's uh, make it a pluck in Serum. So to do that, you could just take the LFO one, tie it to oscillator A, turn it to envelope mode and it will pluck. Cool, let's make it sound a lot less uh, terrible. So let's go to analog, how about acid? Let's get some movement in there, let's slow it down. some effects. The automated reverb sound. Let's take that arpeggio up an octave. Let's get rid of our sustain pedal. This one, since it's already super not uh, realistic sounding, since it's a synthesizer, we don't, all the humanizing thing doesn't matter as much, even though we are humanized here. is a uh, trippy there. Let's take that, let's filter it. So in Logic, we could use our EQ, turn on that high um, shelf or high cut, then go to high cut frequency, drag it down.
Nice. And for fun, let's uh, program in some drums. Use some built-in drums to make this a little bit faster. Oh, let's create another new one. Default, let's go to our drum machines. Let's use a 909, can't go wrong with a 909. All right. Let's do a standard backbeat. symbols on a different uh, layer let's do some just straight 16th notes tip here you could take uh, your velocity and do some cool um, movement here I'm gonna take these notes and turn them down like that trill out at the end just for fun. All right. No uh, beat like this is uh, ready without some bass. Let's go back ahead into Serum. We'll take just the root note, which we're in the key of D minor, so that will be a D. that only we're going to make it sound a lot better so simple 808 we could go to analog bd sign down an octave it already feels super heavy let's uh give it some trail to it call it a half note a little bit more uh, audible. Let's add a second one up an octave. So nice. Let's hear this from the beginning.
that main part feel a little bit more active. You could always go in and cycle different arpeggios. this uh, sound a lot more interesting, our pluck with some FM. Cool. Um, so not bad, not the best thing I've ever made, but not bad for a short little beat writing session. So once again, we wrote the piano or made it sound a lot more human in our making video piano sound real video. So make sure you check that out. If you found this helpful, you would help me out a ton by subscribing to the channel. Tell your friends uh, we're here for a good cause. We just want to share uh, music skills so that anybody can make the music of their dreams. So the only limitation is our own creativity. So be kind to your fellow human being. Have yourself a wonderful day, and I will see you next time. Cheers.